all right all right hello guys welcome back to another video today we are going to be continuing this game um i hope you guys watched the first video if you haven't already it will be in the description below or yeah anyways let's go ahead and get started it's day one apparently Hello? Oh, the race. You still there? Is that a joke? Yeah. Well, you're improving. What's up? Mm. Oh, nothing. I mean, I just wanted to say, you got everything you need to have a smooth night. But you should take a look at the main power system. You know, no one's been up there since... Leonard's death. Uh, five days might not seem like much, but the Timberline has an age. I don't know. When I lived here, I was only a kid. I can barely find the bathroom. That well, that's a uh, good start. <laughs> like, at least I won't wet myself? Um, no. I, I didn't mean... Don't blush, kid. I was just kidding. Oh. <laughs> I just... I'll call if I need you. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know about this. This game, um... It's very sketchy so far. Bathrooms don't look great. So I have to find a bathroom? Downstairs. Alright. I think we're fine. Irving? It's me again, obviously. I could really use a shower. Sure. You'll just need to turn on the furnace for the hot water. Oh, my mom never wanted me to go down there, but I loved that place. Full, Full of, of spiders. little spiders. A real country bumpkin. <laughs> oh, I was a pest. Now, I think I even forgot how to get there. I forgot almost everything about this hotel. Funny, right? People forget what hurts, I think. Never enough, Irving. Never enough. Yeah. Well, furnaces are always in the basement. You won't have trouble finding it. Is there something else I should know, like, to survive? Well, I don't expect a five-star menu. Oh, really? Uh, you could survive for months with what's in the pantry. Let me guess. Canned beans, right? Bean soup. Baked beans, potatoes and beans, bean broth. <laughs> Starving beans everything. suddenly seems like an acceptable option. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, um, it seems like we have to go to the furnace, of course. Which, I'm assuming it's in the boiler. Because I don't see the basement on this map. that sound? Freaked out a little bit. I don't want anybody to pop out of nowhere and like, rah, you know, attack me. He says I'm safe down here, but I don't know. It's pretty spooky. Guess we'll see. Irving. Okay. Are you at the furnace? He's waiting for me. He's down there. What? Who? Old farting ghost. Wait, what did you say? <laughs> Old farting... <laughs> All right. I used to hide down there with hotel guest kids and wait for old farting ghost to come and get us. Farting... the furnace? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. When Leonard found out, he almost choked laughing. Your father laughed about stuff like that? Yeah. Well... That's long gone. I think it's the boiler room. Right? I'm assuming. I'm actually really nervous to go in here. Oh my god. 
Well, that's scary. Why is everything... Okay. Is it us? <laughs> I'm all freaked out. Wait, how do we turn it on? Okay. How's it going? It looks real... Complicated. complicated. Furnaces are all the same. Can you see the control panel? Uh, I guess. What does the pressure gauge read? Huh? The thing that looks like a clock. Looks like 220. Oh. I don't like the sound of oh. oh. It should be more like 210 PSI. Pressure's building. You saying I have a choice between freezing or blowing up? <laughs> no. Push the green button. It's the starter. Old farting ghost, you rank spirit. Wake up. Huh? Nothing. Just talking to an old friend. All right. <laughs> All right, here we go. So there's gonna be behind me. Something's gonna be behind me. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. And here he is, in tip top shape, I'd say. <laughs> you were right. The furnace is haunted. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now you've got hot water. You have no idea how grateful I am. Just doing my job. All right. That is sketchy. I don't know about being in this big building. If I was in this kind of circumstance, I would probably like be in one room. <laughs> I don't care. I would not be walking around everywhere. This is huge. Like, there's so many like. Rooms. Give me some good news. Uh, just letting you know that the rooms will heat up before the hallways. I just want to go to bed. Did you find a room you feel comfortable in? Yeah, my old room. It's exactly like I left it. Leonard cleaned it, but he didn't touch a thing. Same as you left it? Exactly. How does that make you what feel? What is that? <laughs> they teach psych classes at FEMA. Well, just being nice. It's endearing. But I'm not 16 anymore. There's lots of other rooms in the hotel. No. I think I'll sleep just fine. Okay. Okay. So I guess we're going to go back to our room. Irving Crawford, FEMA. Hey. Oh. Hey. Listen, I just wanted hey. to say, if I came across as obnoxious... No problemo. <laughs> I get it. Almost feels like I'm getting used to being here again. Whatever. Forget it, I'm beat, and I'm rambling. No, no, I, From the rumors that went around the valley about when you left the hotel, and all that rush, well... Right, I forgot. The Wilsonian mythology. Sorta. Now I'm just gonna chill in my room, with the posters of my favorite bands, playing my old bass, Totally unplugged. You play the bass? I suck. I wanted to thank you. Knowing that I'm not alone here is a huge deal. Yeah, well, uh, thank you for um, listening and not freezing to death in your car. So I owe you my life then. Wow. It's just... Your job. I know. Night. 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 Okay, I guess we're chilling in my room. Right? <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna actually pick it up. You know, day two, okay. You know the only instrument I've ever played is piano? And I'm really terrible at it. The only song that I actually got into was probably Rihanna. Um, featuring Mickey, Mickey Echo. What's that song? Oh my gosh. But I didn't get to finish the whole song, unfortunately. So, day two. We didn't really do anything much. All we did was morning. literally... Good morning, Nicole. <sighs> get any sleep? Like a rock, so I'm out cold. 
Um... I was wide awake for hours. Then suddenly, darkness. <clears throat> so, any news? Oh, uh, what? Is the situation on the roads any better? Just, um, give me a sec to get it together. Maybe I need some coffee. I didn't get any shut eye last night and... Wait, you didn't sleep? Like, at all? I thought you might need something and... But... I... You didn't go home? Because of me? I'm a workaholic. Oh... What? So, uh, meteorologists are predicting a peak real soon. Probably tonight. Uh, you can't move, not just yet. In theory. Uh, what do you want to do? Better off thinking without primal needs. I don't want to change the subject. Uh... Mm. I'm not ready for this kind of news at the crack of dawn. I'll eat, and then I'll think about it. It's time for you to take a tour of the pantry. I have to survive. Yeah, I need to get something in my stomach or I won't make it out of here alive. Where's the power of the kitchen? You'll be forever grateful yeah. for baked beans. So it's on the main floor, okay. Okay, so, so far all we ever did was walk around, find out right Turn on the furnace, and now we're gonna go to the pantry to to find something to eat. It's so. Oh jeez, that scared Nicole? me. Irving, uh, how long has it been since someone's inspected the pantry? Inspected? You mean stocked? I just like to know if I should choose between malnutrition and food poisoning. There'll be tons of things to eat. Mm. Oh, definitely no mice or roaches. Pretty sure about that. Okay, so the kitchen. I'm more concerned about the bacterial world. Mouse ain't my deal of a roommate. I was thinking more like mold, bacteria, and such. Uh, you'll see. There's nothing to worry about. Really? I had an ant farm? Okay. The pantry. I'm assuming is right here. We're gonna close the door because we are very paranoid. <sighs> There's some food, but it looks moldy. Weird. I didn't expect that. Uh, there's a freezer. Take a look there. Okay. We're gonna starve, guys. Okay, um, where's the freezer? Fridge. Okay. That's creepy. Oh god, this whole this whole place is so creepy. Why? Did we close the door? Oh my gosh, what if somebody like locks the door on us? Is this a fridge or a freezer? Oh, we found something. Mucho lunch. Muggle lunch. <laughs> Does it say Betty Crocker? That's funny. Oh, heck no. I knew that. <sighs> oh, no. Oh, no. Hey. Are you kidding? You kidding? Oh, shoot. Oh no. How are we gonna get out of here? Oh. What the heck? That was oh, weird. Uh, I almost forgot. There might be a problem with the fridge door. Just make sure it doesn't close. Are you close. fucking with me? No. Wait, what did I say? It would have been more useful to know that before I got locked in. Oh, holy shit. I'm a freaking space cadet. Yeah. I could have died in there. <laughs> yeah. Could have died. Wow, I freaked out a little bit. Here we are making our lunch. Hmm. 
is very interesting so far, but I mean, it is pretty creepy, but nothing creepy has happened except for that fridge thing, but I guess, or the freezer door thing, but I guess it's just normal for it to happen. And we're just waiting for our food to be made. <laughs> Warm up again. Okay. Right. Here we are having lunch. Eat up. Be. <laughs> Does that even taste good? Well, we are full. Okay. Uh huh. Sorry to interrupt your continental breakfast. Uh, I got a hold of Mr. Jenkins, the attorney. When's he getting here? I'm only taking good news. I'm only taking good news today. Otherwise, let me eat. Up to you. Thought you'd like to know. Oh, come on. He called 911 after just a mile. Well, I might as well finish the inspection. I can do it without Jenkins. Uh, he told me to give you a message. Here it is. He says to... Hmm. This is a swear word and you don't need to hear it. Uh, yeah. Uh, Nicole, at this point, start assessing the general conditions of the hotel on your own. Uh, jot down what you want to keep. I recommend you start with the second floor. It's surely the most damaged. Please. Only call me if you've got good news. Only. All right, guys. I will stop it here. I know this game is very um, spooky, but uh, nothing spooky hasn't really necessarily happened, but I hope you guys are enjoying it so far. Um, again, I don't know how much parts there is going to be in this series, but I hope you guys stick around with me. If you guys liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. I cannot wait to play more games in the future. And I hope you guys will stick around. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.